Welcome to Crema Media's Resources Watch, a weekly video roundup of the events and people making and shaping the news in the mining industry. This week, cost bites see Harmony profits fall, RB Platt says Stale Drift 2 may need a 10 billion rand investment, and Exaro to step up capex to 7.1 billion rand next year. CEO Graham Briggs on the outlook for gold and how the company plans to raise output in the short term. We've always been gold bulls and, and so we're seeing uh, something a little bit more these days with all the financial crisis around and so on. But, uh, you know, we're very, very gold bulls and, and um, so it's, it's very important to all gold miners. Um, but uh, we'll see an increase in our margins. Uh, that we'll see quite quite quickly. Uh, of course, you know, when we see the gold price as it is today, it's only been like it for just over a week or so. Um, but, you know, we, we're here for the longer run, so we also have to look at the longer term as well. Our real focus has been on increasing gold production from our newer assets. Uh, so these are the assets we spent a lot of capital expenditure on. Uh, Dernkorp, Pakisa, Kasasaletu, uh, Hidden Valley and PNG. And that's really where our growth of gold is coming from and should come from in the future. South Africa's black-owned Royal Buffer King Platinum said its organic growth strategy could result in a 10 billion rand investment in the Stale Drift 2 project. We intend to the to keep our production flat uh, com uh, compared to 2010 for the 2011 year. Um, the one thing that's proved very valuable for us, as you will recall, that part of our strategy is that we would focus on mining Marensky, but we started the co-extraction of UG2 to provide us with flexibility in our business. That's when we took over in January 2010. And certainly for this six-month period, that has proven to be the right decision because the drop of 11% in our Marensky was fully made up by the additional UG2 ounces that we could mine and that, that certainly has helped us to maintain our production at the level that we wanted to maintain it. JSE listed Exaro Resources plans to increase its capital expenditure to 7.1 billion rand in the 2012 financial year, which would further complement the miners' diversification strategy. Insofar as our war chest is concerned, I think we we're fairly comfortable with that. I mean, we, you've seen the cash there that we're generating and what we are anticipating going forward. But on top of that, we've got this facility that we have, uh, which is now uh, close to six billion billion rands. And thus far, we've spent all the money out of our own coffers. So we should we should not really be having much of a problem in, in dealing with that. Uh, but of course, diversification is, is, is a big issue for us. We think that the cash that we have and probably raising more capital if, if that becomes necessary. We could do that one in terms of, in terms of getting um, the new projects on in, in, into the fold. For mining news as it breaks, stay logged on to miningweekly.com and register for our free daily newsletter. <laughs>